When asked to factorise, it means put it into brackets. Then you'll either have one set of brackets or two sets of brackets. This is what we call a linear one because there's only going to be one set of brackets. You need to have an x squared term for a quadratic. Okay, so we look at the numbers on both of these. Well, there's an 18 and a 33. Now, I know that, mm, well, 6 goes into 18, but it doesn't go into 33, so it's going to be 3 that we can divide out of both of those. The next thing we look at is if there's a letter they both have. Well, the first one has an X, but the second one doesn't have a letter, so we can't divide out a letter. So I look at that 18, and I say, well, how many 3s can we divide out of that? Well, the answer is going to be 6. We haven't done anything with that X, so I'm just going to leave that in. Okay, we didn't divide it out. And then I ask myself, well, how many 3s go into 33? Well, that's going to be 11. And so my answer is 3 brackets 6x plus 11. Now I can check that answer by doing a quick grid. Nice quick grid. And we've got 3, we've got 6x, and we've got 11. And let's times these out. So we've got 3 times 6 is 18x because it's 6x, and 3 times 11 is 33. So we've got 18x plus 33, which was the question. So we know it's correct.